Tracy. So today I have part two of the four part stay hot for the holiday series. Today our focus is going to be how to stay slim during the holiday season. It's a really scary and daunting fact that during the holiday season most people gain weight. And I've seen studies that show even as much as five to eight pounds, which is a lot of weight. Often what happens too, the, the other sad part, is that that weight usually will stay on. So if each year you're having even as little, little, as one to two pound weight gain, think about it, year after year, that number keeps going up. So I know that you don't want that for yourself. And don't worry, I've got you covered. So my first secret for you is to make sure that you move more. I know you're really smart, and I hope that you're a subscriber here on my YouTube channel, but listen, during the holidays often, we have other family engagements, parties, you know, work events. Your schedule tends to be really packed, and this is the time where we tend to go, I don't have time to work out, I just don't have it, I'm too busy right now. Do not fall into that trap. Make sure that you are moving even a little bit more than usual during the holidays so that you're feeling really confident and staying connected to your body. This simple tip is life-changing if you really do it. So even if you have to calendar your workouts, hire a trainer during this time, make sure that you have workout dates with a buddy, even putting gold stars on the calendar. Whatever you're going to do that's going to motivate you to move more during the holidays will really, really help you, okay? Second tip here is do not starve yourself. I hear this from my clients so often when they'll say, listen, you know, I mean, I know I've got this party or I have this, this dinner tonight, so I'm just not gonna eat during the day. I'm just not gonna eat much at all. One would think that that would help you, but truthfully, it actually is harming you because it's slowing down your metabolism. And, and if you're like me, you're gonna be hungry. You might even be hangry because you're so hungry, you're just kind of pissed. That is not the way to show up for a party. So make sure that you're eating a really good, clean and healthy diet all during the day. Now truthfully, truthfully, if you want to eat a little bit lighter during the day, that's okay. But my tip for you is when you're getting ready to go to the event, you know, you're putting on your makeup, you're doing your hair, you're picking out your outfit, have a little bit of a snack. So really something that preferably incorporates some good healthy fat with whatever you're having. So really simple ideas here would be like maybe an apple with some almond butter, maybe a good quality nutrition bar, even some, you know, if you eat meat, some rolled up turkey in, in a lettuce wrap. Anything is really possible here that works for your diet just to make sure that you take that edge off so you are not starving to death when you show up to your event, okay? The third secret here that to stay slim for the holidays is to have smart drinks, okay? Often, uh, what I find for myself is I'll go to a party and I'm really thirsty because I talk all day, so, uh, you know, someone will hand me a glass of wine and I drink it. Now, you know, I, that's fine if you drink alcohol, but the truth is I find that I'm drinking a little bit faster because I'm actually truly thirsty. So the best super simple secret here is to start with a glass of water or club soda, seltzer, at the start of the party. So have one to two glasses. Have it in your fancy glass, you know, no, no shame there. I do that all the time. Have like a champagne flute full of seltzer, no big deal. Have a couple of those before you even go to your first drink. And then when you have your drink, choose your drinks wisely. Don't have anything with whipped cream on it, no eggnog, nothing that's really a meal in a glass, unless it's a smoothie, of course. Make sure that it's just really simple. Glass of wine, you know, a simple drink like a vodka and soda if you drink alcohol at all, okay? And the last and final tip here is to make sure that you are stressing less, okay? Stress leads to cortisol. The hormone cortisol, when it is raised, it leads to weight gain and specifically belly fat. And I know that you do not want to have some belly fat for the holidays. That's only for Santa. So make sure that you are doing whatever you can do to minimize your stress here. Taking deep breaths, making sure that you're mindful of your body, really amping up your self-care. You can find some really great meditation videos here on my channel. You know, do whatever you need to do to just take it down a notch and chill because that's really how you're going to enjoy the holidays, okay? Do we have a deal? All of these tips are super useful, but they are not useful until and unless you put them into action. So I'm gonna give you a little challenge. I want 
want you to leave me a comment below and let me know which of these tips you implemented during this week, okay? Let me know how it went for you and I can't wait to hear from you. Okay, see you next time, bye.